Welcome, good morning. Uh, my name is uh, Karel Inthout from the University of uh, Antwerp uh, in uh, Belgium. So an outline of this course is as follows. Um, we will focus in this talk on a prototype multidimensional uh, partial differential equation in finance, which is a prominent one, that is the Heston PDE. It is two-dimensional and we will explain that in uh, the first part uh, of the talk. Um, so this functions as a prototype. The methods that we devise will be applicable also in other situations, also in, for example, three-dimensional models, but that will not be part of this uh, talk, but the schemes you will see can be generalized to that situation as well. And the numerical solution approach that we follow consists of two steps. First, we are going to discretize in uh, what we call space. So that's the physical uh, interpretation, and that means uh, in the S and V variables in the Heston uh, PDE. That will be the first uh, step. Uh, we will do that by finite differences. Um, we will present in part three numerical experiments just concerning this finite difference discretization and see the accuracy of that discretization. Then time is still continuous. And now we will move uh, to the discretization of that uh, system, that semi-discrete system you have obtained after finite difference discretization in part five. That is where the, the actual uh, core of our course is, I would say. That is the ADI schemes. So ADI stands for alternating direction implicit. It's not uh, a new idea. It stems already from the 50s, but the applications in finance have several aspects that were not considered originally uh, by the inventors of uh, ADI. And that poses several challenges. And we will discuss those in part uh, five and develop uh, suitable adaptations of the original uh, schemes. In part uh, six, we will then explain uh, the stability analysis of those schemes. And that contains several recent uh, results from the literature. And especially the so-called mixed derivative term plays an important uh, part, an important role uh, there. In uh, part seven, we will then present uh, numerical experiments for the ADI schemes. Uh, we will study the time, disc the time discretization by ADI schemes and consider the convergence and the stability in actual applications of those uh, schemes. In uh, part eight, we will move to extensions. So the first uh, part of the talk will be for a rather simple uh, kind of option, namely the standard European call option, um, in which case you don't actually need a discretization, but this serves as a test case for our methods. So in part eight, we will explain uh, extensions uh, to options, for example, uh, barrier options, for which there are no closed form uh, formulas. But we will also consider other extensions. And then an interesting, uh, also an interesting part of this course is that in part nine, we will present in detail uh, the MATLAB code that we have written for this uh, application. Uh, so we call that the Heston ADI uh, code. So we will go through that uh, step by step and it's available in the, the course uh, notes. And finally, in part uh, 10, we will present uh, the relevant uh, literature.